Hello and welcome to the first Warriors HQ ahead of the 2016-17 season. Coming up on this week's show, we speak to Gregor Townsend following the announcement he'll become head coach of Scotland in June 2017. We catch up with Canada international prop Justice Sears Duru ahead of the Warriors pre-season fixture with Canada A. And we're at the club golf day at the Carrack, sponsored by Harry Fairbairn BMW. So Gregor, you must be honoured to be named as the new Scotland coach from June 2017. Yeah, incredibly proud, um, incredibly fortunate and grateful for the, the opportunity. Uh, I've having a great time uh, as coach at Glasgow um, and I'm really grateful for the opportunity I had over four years ago to become the coach here and uh, yeah, uh, it will be a, be a great honour but uh, obviously it's next season and we've got a lot of work to do this season. So these opportunities don't come around very often, it must be very exciting for you to be taking up that role at the end of the next season. Yeah well obviously thanks Scottish Rugby for the opportunity uh, first and foremost, they, they gave me the opportunity with, with Glasgow four years ago but also the, the people that have Help <laughs> enable me get get this uh, get this job in uh, next season, which are the players first and foremost. Um, they're the one that, that play the games, they do the hard training, that that win games. Um, the support staff we have here, um, on and off field, but especially the coaching staff, make my job my, much easier one. So I'm I'm very grateful for for everyone around the club and also also the supporters. I think they they've been really supportive. Um, off the team, it's been brilliant um, coaching this team and seeing how well it connects with with the uh, the supporters. And we've had lots of special days and nights here at Scotston, and I'm looking forward to a few more this season. Scottish wheelchair racer Sammy Kinghorn was at Scotston Stadium last week as part of a Harper McLeod Road to Rio event held in the Harper McLeod Club deck. Sammy will be competing at the Paralympics in Rio later this month and did a Q&A with the guests along with Warriors winger Lee Jones. It must be difficult gelling the teams, or teams from three different nations. So I suppose the question is, how did the Scots and, and the Welsh put up with the English boys? <laughs> and I remember going out and seeing this girl and she was pushing around the track and she was overtaking runners. And I was just like, wow, like, like, I, it takes a lot to take the words out of my mouth and that really did and I, I just couldn't believe that you know she was going faster than and I always wanted to see myself being better than what I was before just so to see her going around that track and, and overtaking runners and such a smart bit of kit it didn't look like a disability it just it looks cool this week we caught up with Canada international prop Justice Sears Dudu ahead of the upcoming pre-season fixtures against Harlequins Gloucester and Canada A Justice, it's been announced that on Tuesday the 30th of August, Glasgow will play a pre-season friendly in Stirling against your home nation, Canada, that you've played for 19 times. What was your reaction when you found out that you'd be taking on your own side? I was very excited. A lot of great guys coming over, so I'm excited to play against them and see what we do. Excited to get out on the field for Glasgow and do my best. It's been announced that it's the home base players um, for Canada. Tell us a bit about them. There's certainly a strong outfit. Yeah, a lot of strong guys, a lot of new guys coming as well, so it'll be a nice mixed squad. Well, they'll all be training on Langford now, so they're full-time training and I expect good things from them. You obviously played for Canada um, just in the summer there. Have you been speaking to many of the teammates when it was announced that they would be taking on the Warriors? Yeah, I talked to a couple of the guys, a little back and forth, seeing how they're going, a little ribbing, but they're excited about it, excited about their tour and I think it should be good for them. You've obviously played against the Warriors before for Canada um, in that last game in Nova Scotia. What was that experience like for you? Well, it was a great experience. My first little chance to see the Warriors like, live and... They're a great team, I'm glad to be here and excited for things to come. What have the supporters to expect from this um, pre-season friendly when they turn up? What have they to expect from Glasgow Warriors against Canada? A lot of fast-paced rugby, a lot of hard-hitting and um, still everything new. It'll be good. The supporters haven't seen you um, turn out in a, in a Warriors jersey yet, but you've also been working hard in pre-season training. How have you found that? I've been good. Pre-season's been very tough. We're working hard every day. I like to see our boys getting better every single day, so I'm excited to play for us. We've got two pre-season friendlies coming up before we take on Canada. Um, what's your thoughts ahead of them? Two um, big sides and put about two big tests in the shape of Harlequins and Gloucester. Oh, it should be good. The boys are going to play together for the first time for the first season and uh, be good to see what we got. A lot of, a lot of new plays and stuff, a lot of new players, so it should be a little frantic at first, but I think we'll do well. You're wearing the new kit. Um, what do you make of it? Oh, it's nice. Very nice kit. I like it a lot. And how determined are you to, to pull on that jersey for real and run out here at Scotland? Oh, very determined. It's my goal to play for the Warriors and I'm glad I'm here. 
This week, Glasgow Warriors announced a new partner to the Scots and family. HF Group are now the club's 12th partner with headquarters in Glasgow and branches throughout the UK. Earlier this month, we were at the club's annual golf day at the Carrick Loch Lomond, where a number of sponsors, players and coaches took to the fairways. John Mackay, Operations Director, 17 over par after four. Second shot into the fourth. And it's a lovely strike, he's looking at it. He's left it short, oh. That's all for this week's Warriors HQ. Don't forget to watch our pre-season fixture against Harlequins this Saturday, live and exclusive for free on Warriors TV. Kickoff is at 4pm and we'll be back next Wednesday at 5pm on Warriors TV.